So you're a YouTuber and you royally McChicken f***ed up your entire career. What did you do that was so wrong? Did you accidentally manipulate several underage fans into sending nudes to you? Did you attempt to meet for sex with a 13 year old fan but when you got there all you could do was talk about your undying love for cupcakes? Did you accidentally promote a fake gambling website to your underage fans and cause them to spiral into a cripplingly painful gambling addiction? If you did anything like that, you gotta make an apology video for it and you gotta do it as soon as possible. Now I know exactly what you're thinking. I'm not sorry, why should I make an apology video? Well, just know this. Making a YouTube apology video has absolutely nothing to do with you apologizing for your actions. We both know you're not sorry, don't even consider apologizing. Simply follow these three easy steps and it'll make sense. With that in mind, let's get on to the first step. A good introduction is essential when it comes to a YouTube apology video. There are several ways you can start an apology video, such as petting a dog. You want to do this as you want to give off the impression that you're a human, just like your fan base of lower slash middle class 11 year olds who can afford pets. However, you don't have a lot in common given that you're far more rich than them. Never forget to remind them of that by subtly placing some expensive items in the background for them to see. Another solid technique you can use is just giving away fake Amazon gift cards. Make yourself look like a philanthropist that just gives out free Amazon gift cards out of the kindness of your own heart. Remember to never actually give out valid codes, it's part of the process. One of my favorite ways to open up an apology video is by blaming the audience right away. Just passive aggressive blame your audience for not being able to understand your galaxy brain play. After all, your fan base is pretty stupid. While all of these are bulletproof and fine, if you want something simpler to start your YouTube apology with, look directly into the camera with a simple background, inhale, exhale, and just say something along the lines of, I'm sure by now you've already heard the news. I never wanted to make this video. I just want to say I love you all. That's a pretty solid way to start and I recommend it to every beginner. So now that you have your intro done, it's time for step two. What are some things you should say in your apology video? Well, it's really not that hard. All you really need to say is that you had a terrible lapse in judgment, you were lost and confused, your mental health wasn't in the best state of being at the time of your dumb actions. Make sure whatever you do, don't put the blame on yourself. Blame someone else or blame something else. Something else you should do is excessive fake crying. This definitely will make you look remorseful and genuine. Something else you can do is make the video incredibly long to get as much ad revenue from it as you possibly can, or make it as short as possible if you're feeling lazy. All you gotta do is just shift the blame on something else, stretch it out, fake cry, it's not that hard. Now with that step out of the way, let's get on to the third and final step. So it's time to wrap up your apology video. You're done fake crying for the day. Now it's time for some parting words. End by saying something simple like make sure you subscribe and hit the like button even though a portion of the people watching this are already subscribed. Just remember to end by not saying you're sorry. That is a vital part. Some parting words can include, so uh, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. I'm not expecting forgiveness. Get creative with it. Now it's time to turn the camera off and get editing. You can either have the whole video uncut and just play the whole thing, or you can have multiple cuts every four seconds. And after you've edited the whole video, it's time to upload it and make sure when you upload the video, make sure it's all lowercase, but also punctually correct. If there are more than four words in your title for your apology video, change it right away. It is not authentic. Now your video is up. It's got over 10 million views and a 30 to 70% like to dislike ratio, which is better than 100% dislike. Am I right? And just wait until Moist Critical makes a video about your apology video and slaps it onto a tier list. That'll look really good for you. A YouTube apology video is very easy to make and you can get a good chuckle out of it. So if you're a YouTuber in trouble, make sure you follow this guide and make a YouTube apology video as soon as possible. Otherwise, you're screwed. So you know what to do. Get out there and make your video, champ. You got this. They thought I was dead. They put three bullets in the back of my head and called it a s They tossed my body out in the middle of Pelican Bay and thought it would be eaten by the birds. But without realizing it, 
The bastards made one simple fatal flaw in their equation to eradicate me from the depths of Earth. You cannot kill off meme culture, baby! <laughs> Did you miss me? Guess who's back, motherfuckers? It's your boy Chungo Wunga here to bring you some important information that is going to save your inevitably tarnished legacy. So I heard that you got caught fiddling with little kitty's cupcakes, and now you're in a bit of a pickle, I see. Well, fear not, for I, the rabbit who can probably eat more grilled cheese sandwiches in one sitting than an entire homeless shelter, is here to showcase my new line of business. Drum roll, please. The YouTube Apology Super Center for Undeserving Careers. Otherwise known as the Y-T-A-S-C-U-C. Here we have the finest products at your disposal to make the worst... I, I, no, I mean best YouTube apology that has graced this side of the Mississippi. Do you even know where Mississippi is? I think not. You know with all that time on your device committing more felonies than Aaron Hernandez when the CTE kicks in, you should probably add more knowledge to that filthy fuck. <coughs> I, <coughs> I mean, I incredible head you have in between your shoulders. God, please... Kill me. Anyways, back to our products. Here we have the widest variety at your disposal. Now follow me as I show you our line of products and categories. Are you guys ready? Yes, yes, let's yes. do this shit. Hell yeah, I'm so yeah, ready. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Get more Broncos. Step for Broncos are going to the Super Bowl. All right, all you scam artists and possible future jail sentence recruits, let me give you the best goddamn tour of your life. We have terrible excuses, references for how to do something as simple as f***ing breathe. Also, never saying sorry for anything that you did and just blaming it on your mental health or trauma. And w w whatever the hell this thing is. Like, seriously, who the hell in her PR department thought this is a good idea? Like, what the actual f- Anyways, I hope you little whippersnappers or those who go after said whippersnappers have a good glance at what is left of our inventory because it seems like every YouTuber as of now is making some sort of stupid mistake. But hey, at least most of them aren't going after kids' tater tots. And if someone like you that has ruined their reputation on YouTube, be sure to come on down to the YouTube Apology Super Center for Undeserving Careers at Y-T-A-S-C-U-C. -C, or call us at the phone number down below. But seriously, though, if you've done this type of stuff that warrants you need to follow this tutorial, do yourself a favor and seek a therapist. Anthony Padilla has a discount code at BetterHelp.com, so why not use our better off? Just turn yourself in. F YouTube Apology Super Center for Undeserving Careers. This place makes the island of misfit toys look like a Toys R Us, come on down!